Getting into the Muldraw Police Department and Video Store was easier than I thought it would be. The zombies had spread out since I drove through last and the crowds I planned to burn were not as dense as when I returned. I used the Molotovs nonetheless and made short work of the zombies that were shambling about. It only took a couple of minutes until they were ash. After entering the police department, I received my first and possibly fatal injury, a laceration. We will have to monitor our health for the next couple of days as it heals, as we could possibly be zombified and not even know it. We did walk away with a good amount of guns and ammo, though. Good afternoon. Welcome to Eric Gaming. This is David. We're playing Project Zomboid. It's been 12 days, 5 hours, 383 zombies killed, 88 kilograms going down, getting close to 85. I uh, got lacerated last episode. I don't know if we will make it. Let's uh, go ahead and remove and dress our wounds. I immediately disinfected. Ate a little bit of food to get a little... Whoops, not a dirty bandage. Let's do a clean bandage. And this is where we are. Everything's stale. I need some food. We actually need to get a little bit of food. Um, I shouldn't have eaten all of that. Let's just eat a portion of that. Still trying to keep my weight down. And I think we're going to take it easy today. I think we are going to head back to the bookstore. We are going to collect some more books. Uh, hopefully it shouldn't be too bad. We did most of the clearing out. However, I also accidentally honked my horn before we left. Just taking a look at a couple of weapons I might grab. Why is this music so sad and somber? I guess it's appropriate for the cut. Because this, this could be the end of David. Um, there's a percentage, uh, like a 20% chance I might zombify because of this wound. Um, I'm, I'm also going to keep the axe. We're going to try to get our axe skill up. Let's get our duffel bag in here. Uh, we have nothing in the way of axe skill. Literally zero. Whoops. So, um, no, don't do that. Um, we will uh, take it easy. Go slow. A few at a time. It's a not a, not a multi-hit game. Um, it is zombie apocalypse. Or apocalypse. And... It's just hitting one zombie at a time, so I am exerting more energy and killing zombies at a slower rate than I would with multi-hit. So, yeah, we've been clearing out the neighborhood. It's pretty, pretty cleared out. I'm gonna head south and see what the damage is. We've already conducted one burn. I had to abandon the bookstore earlier because I was just too tired. Uh, I was in pain and it took me forever just to... I don't even think I killed a zombie. I accidentally startled a zombie right before we got into the bookstore. And I just kept thwapping them and thwapping them and nothing was happening. They just kept coming for me. None of them went down. None of them died. sharp of a turn. Um, and there's a lot of zombies in the street. Acorn Plaza. I'm about halfway there. A little bit more. We're almost there. Getting close. Trying to preserve the van, which is why I'm weaving through the zombies the way I am. This is the best vehicle we've had so far. It's really the only vehicle we've had so far, and it's a pretty damn good one. I haven't checked the engine. I'm sure it's taken some damage since I've taken over occupation of it. Okay. Uh, getting close. Greens. Definitely going to have to kill. That's what the axe is for. It's a fire axe. This might be a result of the honking. Um, so it's the most ideal axe weapon. Just going to pull south a bit more. Turn off engine. Get out. Whoops. I put away the axe. Okay. Uh, so, also, maybe the weapon choice was not the best when I was attacking earlier. This has damage of, what's that, about 50. And these have a damage of a quarter. What does Pipe Wrench have? About the same, about the same as a pipe. So, 
this axe is going to provide more damage, but we're at such a low level, it's, it's going to take a while. Not going to take too long. Next thing we're going to level up is our uh, shotgun, our aiming. Now, just, I'm, it's not multi-hit, which really sucks, because I hate doing these one at a time. And I got a hit. Accumulating zombies. I really wish we had some beta blockers. a close one. Jeez, I really wish these guys would go down. Is it because I'm scared? Is it this? I just can't, can't seem to get these guys to die. I can hit them. I can hit them all day long. But I just seem to seem to can't seem to get them to die. Have I killed a zombie yet today? I don't think so. All I've done is gone in circles and caress their face with the blade of this axe. And it's very discouraging. How many times have I hit that green guy? Seriously. And I'm just going to wear myself out. Come on. There's one. Hey, two zombies killed. Still working on the green guy. There he goes. see a little bit of patterns in this and how I can uh, fight more aggressively. Stick through your abdomen. Yeah. 
Ow. That took a long time to kill a small horde. Like a really long time. And I'm not even at the bookstore. Uh, something flashed on the screen really quick, and it was so quick I couldn't see what it was. I might be able to pause that frame and post and see what that was. Uh, that's pretty shit. I was able to level up my electrical skill last episode, so we are working on level 2. Might want to take a load off and go into the police station. I'm going to need shotguns in the future. Um, and just sit down. Yeah, this has been really difficult. I'm having a lot more trouble getting back into the groove of this. A lot of it does have to do with the one of the time zombies. It just takes so long to take out a large crowd because you're you're literally focused on one zombie at a time. Exerting all of your energy on one zombie at a time. And unable to uh Well, hit two at a time. Now in multi-hit, if you swing and hit two at a time, do you exert the same amount of energy as if you hit one? Or because you hit two zombies, does it uh does it take double the exertion? I I don't know these answers. So that might be another reason why I'm feel like I'm overexerting myself is because I'm literally doubling my my exertion and I'm gonna just preemptively take some of these since we're out here just to keep us away from getting too tired caffeine pills essentially perks you up and take pills more left <laughs> Do you not see me? You just on a stroll? On a walk, so to speak? Okay, those are done. Take pills. Clean bandage. Throw bandage in here. Heading up to the bookstore. We can do this. Not a problem. How's the axe looking? And of course, it also means the dub. Oh, that looks pretty good. Um, doing double the damage for the axe. So if I hit two zombies at a time with one swing and multi-hit, does it do twice the amount of damage to the axe? Should be getting my axe, first level of axe skill up here soon, right? Feels like it should be soon. Um, the front door is locked, but I will break a window as long as there's not a bunch of zombies. Oh, got somebody on me. Any of you see me? No, but I'm close enough to get your attention. One level. One level. One level. Can't assemble that kind of a watch. Getting really warm. These guys weren't here before, were they?
smoke. Yeah, getting rid of any of these negative moodles is a priority for me right now. Because it just seems like I'm so affected by them. I thought I saw a walkie-talkie. I didn't. Pain is back. Man, I hope we did not get zombified from that scratch. This seems to be extremely painful. Still have a Molotov cocktail to burn, too. Uh, pain pills are on my main inventory. Let's take them. We are finally getting into this bookstore. Just gonna go ahead and bust this window. And clear out the glass. Okay, now we need carpentry two. Two. Okay. Don't need one, don't need one. I think I need that. Trapping one I have. Carpenter 5, I'll need. Cooking 1, do I need? Uh, yes. Just for a little bit. Cooking 1. Farming 3. I need farming 2 right now, I believe. There's a number of magazines I have at home that I have yet to read. Now, are these books? These are not books. These are books, though. Cooking four. I hear some. Don't need that. This I'll take. And that, ah, sure. Bag is full. That means I can no longer use the axe, at least double handed. Sounds like someone's snoring. Carpentry 2, here we go. We are on our way. Volume 1, I have. Volume 3, I'll take. Volume 5, sure. Tailoring, I'm going to skip. Did, did I grab one? Electrician 2, I do. Carpentry 1, electrician, farming 1, foraging, I will take. Metalworking, I'll take. I may have some of these. I don't have an inventory compiled in my head. Property 5 I just grab. First aid I will not need. Foraging 2 I might need. Metal working I think I just grabbed, didn't I? In fact I have three, two of them. And Property 3 Cooking Volume 2 No, I'll skip that. I never get up that high. No. Metalworking 2. Sure, and this. I think I have an, a third at home. A metalworking 3 at home. Farming volume 4. What did I grab? I thought I had a farming book. Farming 3. Uh, four. I do not have that. Are we done? I think we're done. So let's check. Two, three, four, five. Uh, that's that's it. There's no six. So we are done with carpentry, cooking, volume two, volume one. Cooking volume 2, cooking volume 4, that's exactly what I have. Let's get some water and get out of here. And in fact, let's go nightstick. Oh, 
Okay, so bookstore's done. We have completed this task. Shame we had to come back and after a laceration, but we finally made it. No one in our way. We're just going to head back. What else can we do? We do need to go visit McCoy's. I'm not tired whatsoever. I slept until about 12 o'clock this afternoon. Uh, because I just got home so late. And was nursing a wound. I felt like there were some more officers out here. Still haven't run into a trailer. It's another thing I would like. We can drive by Cortman, maybe. Get in, we're in Cortman area. Got all these videos last episode. Got a little Dr. Oid's machine as well. No one near me. It's getting dark. Go home and sleep. Or is there a place to sleep here? I think maybe we'll get some sleep and then head up to McCoy's. Start. Start. Must have been the guys I was hearing. Yeah, there's a lot of guys out here. No trailer. Let's uh, take a look at McCoy's, see what McCoy's looks like. We're going to drive by it. Why am I still overweight? I still have a generator in my vehicle. Which I do need to empty out because uh, if I need to make an emergency exit out of this drive, uh, passenger side, I'm unable to because there's a freaking generator on the seat. to hit you, sir. Clump of zombies looking at something in the middle of the road. Did I pass? No, I was going to say, did I pass the intersection? Heading up to McCoy's. It's typically fairly sparse population and I'm not uh, too worried about it. We might be able to rest in one of the break rooms. I think the middle one is the most ideal. The middle building. There's three four main buildings. There's four of them? Yeah, there's four of them. Going in the back entrance. Which is right here. And here we are. This is McCoy's. Building one. The building two here. the light on as we fight. Uh, in fact, I could put the duffel bag in here. Go on. Oh, it's full? Okay. Uh, this can drop. This can drop. What is on me that I can lose some weight and just want to get this out? so overweight. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Okay. Just want to lose 
lose the weight. So I'm not using up so much energy fighting off these guys. Nope, not that way. I think they saw me. Amen. The bad swing. I guess just knocked him down. Not dead. Swing around. Go the other way. Another one. Did you guys die? One at a time. Okay, let's repeat the one at a time pattern over here. One at a time. Jeez, that took forever. I hear it. I, uh, I, uh, uh, oh, it's in the bag. My, my, um, uh, screwdriver. Good, good, good. Gonna get some sleep. Gonna wake up late. Better set my... Oh, it's already set. I thought there was a sofa in here. There is. Right there. Uh, let's get a snack. Man, I am still hurting. What? I mean, that must have been some laceration.
clear the window. Okay, sleep. Let's get some sleep. Sleep. Yes. Hopefully nobody breaks through the window. Smoke. What do we have here? Metal bar. In good condition. Really? Did you really see me? Louisville. Read map. Any other... Let's grab the chips. There are more. Another welder mask. I do not need a welder mask. Are you next door? Are you right here? Hi, buddy. Where's your shirt? How many of you are there in there? in there. Oh yeah, this is full. I gotta empty that out. Well, let's grab the uh, painkillers, which is what I went in there to grab. I got these lockers. Maybe get another bag. We get another bag. I get nothing. And like it. Light bulb. Bleach. Gotta watch out for this corner. We're clear. Lots of bleach. This is just a custodial closet. Go with this as bathroom, maybe? Yeah. Garbage bag? I have enough of those right now. The only reason I collect them is for water. Water collectors. Okay. Anybody in here? Looking fairly clear. Hoping to find some axes. You know what? I think I will wrap this episode up here. And we will just continue tomorrow morning. I, I'm starting to run a little long. Alright, thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye.